Good morning, everyone. Today is Sunday. And weather is lovely weather today in the whole UK. So enjoy. Let's sit in the nice posture. 30 seconds, just take a deep breath. And then sitting in Gyan Mudra, we chant Om for three times. Take a deep breath in. Oh. Oh. Still keeping eyes closed, take your both hand up in the air, rub them together. Make a cup and cover your face with it. Open your eyes, begin to close, palm of your face. Once the hand cools down to body temperature, gently massage over your forehead. I need to see. Then you can. Then your upper left. Then with the index finger, remove your sinus problem. And then with the index finger around the tear duct. Then the V shape around the other side of here to activate the biggest nerve. Back of the neck. And excellent. Body to be healthy, we have to do meditation and we have to do yoga. And the pranayam plays a big part on it. Even to meditate, even to focus, you have to use the breath. To control your mind, which is subconscious mind and conscious mind, you need to slow down your breath. That helps you to connect with yourself, your soul. And that little spirituality. That, and that helps to it also raise your Kundalini from Mulata, Swadhisthan, Solar Plex, Heart, Throat, Third Eye, and the Culture. As you come up, your meditation becomes easier. So first I'm going to talk about meditation. So let's just sit in the Gyan Mudra and just focus on your breath. Two and a half seconds to breathe in and two and a half seconds to breathe out. Keep 
keep doing it, don't stop. Transfer ke dwara, listen to me as well. First, meditation will, can be very hard. You have to look inward and focus on the present moment. Most people look at the past and they dwell on it or they try to plan for future. In the process, they forget the present moment. A lot of people spend a lot of time sitting quietly and still, but this is sometimes very difficult because we have to deal with a lot of distraction in our daily life. Because life may not distraction, it's not push help What are the main benefits of meditation? Mental health makes you better focus and concentrate. It helps you to find yourself, self-awareness, who you are, what's the purpose of life. It gives you more self-esteem, lowers the level of stress, comes to them, anxiety, and you become much more kinder, useful person, person becomes. Keep breathing in and Medical Meditation has benefit for your physical health as well. Improve your tolerance to pain and helps to fight addiction. Addiction, not just alcohol, not just the smoking, could be binge eating, could be anything. Anything you use too much of it, it becomes an addiction. So what are the benefits of meditation? Reduce stress. Emotionally, become calmer and more balanced. Makes you more focused. Reduce pain anywhere in the body. Reduce anxiety. Increase creativity, it reduce depression, you become a happier person, your memory power increases, and you get to know more about yourself, what makes you happy. You can keep breathing in air. Meditation daily helps you to clear your mind and focuses on the present moment. It gives you much more than your, your boost your productivity. Aapka, jo kaam karte hai, uski sam, wo acha ho jata hai. Best place to start by jumping right into the meditation session. Get ready by ignoring any thought for or against, have open mind, will help you to benefit for yourself. It's mostly start with simple breathing exercise, which you are doing just now anyway, for the beginner. So the main thing, meditation balances the body system. Help with chronic pain again, just to set the example, anxiety, stress, improve heart health, boost your mood, increase your immunity, and a lot of other problems as well. Your brain activity increases when you meditate, you're so relaxed. A lot of health centers use the meditation for pain therapy and also with helping with addiction. And also it's very good for young children in learning in memory power. Just 15 minutes. 
meditation a day can enough to produce a good result after some time. And the purpose of meditation is to relax and train your mind to stay at the present moment. So let's start. Let's take your hand off the stubby together. So, let's give it a practice of meditation now. You are all sitting comfortable anyway. Sitting upright. Put your hand this way and go all the way up. Stretch first just to get the spine right and do Kapalvati. One per second, just gentle, listen to the body. Excellent. And meditation, just let me highlight myself. One of the best posture for meditation is you put your left hand or right hand like this. That's why the Buddha Bhagavan used to do that. When you meditate, put your hand this way. Back is safe. Gently close your eyes. And there's three ways you can do. One is to focus on your third eye. Some people focus on the upper left where the first breath goes in when you're born. And some people focus on your heart, which is the main center of focus. So whenever mind wanders around, don't fight it. But slowly bring it back to that focus, whichever point. So you can have either your heart, your upper left, or your third eye. Either, anything. Or uh, some people do it like a look at like the candle in front of your eye level. They look at the candle for a short period and then close the eyes and try to focus on the candle. If the wind is blowing, trying to blow it out, trying to protect it, and then making and focusing on the candle itself. So it's like mind not to go around but focusing on your do something else. Do something else. So, so that's that's what we're trying to do, mate. Listen. As you settle in, allow your all your jaw and your face, everything to be nice and relaxed. So you're just nice and relaxed. Nothing too stiff at all. Take a separate deep breath. And try to focus on your breath. As you breathe in, you can focus your lung expanding, the diaphragm going down, and your stomach coming out. When you breathe out, your stomach going in, facing the compressed the diaphragm and exhaling out all the carbon dioxide. So your belly is expanding and contracting like a balloon. Now sitting in Gyan Mudrana, your back is your eyes closed. And focusing, I said, to your heart, your upper lip, or chin. For the next three minutes, you're going to do it. Just focus on your breath.
your mind does go away somewhere else, don't fight it. Gently bring it back to your focus. You're trying to focus to live in the present moment. If you're doing Khichri Mudra, your meditation becomes easier. Makes you more focused. Mind doesn't go outward, goes inward. Meditation helps you to connect with yourself. Your body is your liability. If you manage to focus on yourself, you go in kind of trance. Not sleeping, you're still aware of your body. You feel the different sensations in your body. Absolutely good old data.
Genji, keep your both hands up in there. Rub them together. And then tell me somebody, what did you feel? What did your body feel like? Uh, peaceful. Calm down. Good. You know, when I close my eyes, and when I'm breathing in and out, my eyes getting like a orange clouds coming, red ones coming, like that, you know, something coming in your... Good. Is, it, is it good or... Yeah, yeah, yeah so good. One thing is, I can't tell what I'm saying, but I'm, I'm in the same yogi path like you all, you all are, so I, I don't you know, have a knowledge of that. But the thing the is clouds, that, clouds coming, the red one. It, it just depends on what level of yogi path you're on. Just yes. depends on your own journey of your life, you know. But it they light, one of the best. lights everywhere. That's, uh, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it's, it's part of a meditation. That's what your mind is. Mind is floating like a cloud, you know, chip into all the different colors. Yeah, get and, cloud. Uh, yeah. Rainbows and all that kind of idea, you know. Yeah, that's, that's happened to me like that. Yeah, excellent. You know, just uh, everything feels differently. But the main thing is you try to hold the time still. Right. You try to live in the present moment. And sometimes I see the candle, not today, but sometimes mm. I see the candle, then it goes, comes That's and it. goes. That's it. When it goes, all you see, the mind, the purpose is mind to make it still. Yeah. Controlling your it's like a gore pa lagam laga rahe. Gore is also not correct, it's straight, it's straight, it's straight, it's straight. That's right. Yeah, it's good, it's a little bit. It just makes it, the body to be healthy, you mm. need yoga. And you need meditation. Both plays an important part in today's life, especially as the dunya with much stress in the world. Yes, yeah. so, so really, how you cope with it is very important. Sometimes, just the dunya can be we get the news very quickly, and we all get stressed about it. You know. Okay. So let's fine. Let's do something. Oh, huh? sorry. Uh, my mind wants a little bit, it keeps wandering, wandering from here to here when I'm trying to meditate a little bit. That's okay. You know, it's just a matter of learning. Once you keep practicing, it will come back to you deeper. But mind does, mind does wonder. That's, That's the problem. What that's, when yeah. you keep bringing it back to the, what I said, to your heart or your, you come back. Eye, or your lip, upper lips. So you just, as you practice, slowly it gets better, easier for you. It just depends on your yogi path, where you are, you know, kind of idea. Mm -hmm. I'm struggling. Okay. Thank you. No, so I'll go further now. Let me just let me meet everybody. So let's go back to now our normal first is to try to clear up all the energy channel. So open your pop cup behind like this and clap with the line thing. Then just on the armpit here. Then other side. Then hand there. And then tapping it. And the last time.
excellent. Let's pull up let's put your hand there. You breathe in and you do that breathe out. Other hand. Excellent. Next, we do the alone below. Left hand on stoma mudra to balance the vayu, pita, and kapha, catabolism, anabolism, and metabolism. Right hand in vayu mudra, we do that for one minute. Main purpose of this is it's alternative nostril breathing to clear any blockage in nervous system. What your mind thinks, body delivers. Excellent. Next, we can do the nitric oxide to make sure all the sleep. Even if you're doing nighttime, if some people can't sleep, just breathing in and doing this exercise, nitric oxide one, you will sleep better. Because your body relaxes, blood flow, everything happens to you. The first way, let's do the prana first. If you scoop some prana from the body, it doesn't have to be stressed, breathe in. Turn your hand right and do that very slowly. It also helps to reduce your stress as well. Last thing. Also, very good one for this is tapping your thymus gland. Breathe in and breathe out your mouth. Let's do the nitric oxide now. Put your palm of the eye over the ears, over it, and put your tongue next to your teeth and do the humming sign. This vibration with the nasal passage will create more 30% more nitric oxide, oxide which helps to improve your health. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Next, we will do some opening the channel. You start with the hand first, put your hand in the front. You all know it, so I'm just going to feel this. And make the fist. Come on the inside and finger the top.
Now make your fingers fist both hands together. Turn them to look. And give it to her. Then go from there. Then turn slightly apart and turn them in off like the white paper. If your hands get tired, just with TLC, just a little like that. That will take the pain away. And do the reverse. Give me a second. So, guys, thank you, guys. Next, two hand there, clap. You feel it off. You're trying to use the muscle, you don't use it on daily basis. If you don't use it, you lose it. Then to the left hand there, right hand to the left side. Then now we do the scissor action. If you smile, you get double the benefit. Excellent. Well done. Excellent. Next, using your shoulder, please. Maybe the reverse. Then do the swimming action. Then the reverse. This will also improve the nitric oxide as well. And then up and down. Then clapping. Your hand there. Excellent. Next to your hand there. Breathe in. With the Jatka Kesal. Tight way. Excellent. 
Then put your fourth hand there, press together, you breathe in. Just take a full loop back and relax. And do the reverse. Next, make a Ganesh Nutra all the way back up, breathe in, keeping head up behind the head, and hold the position. Breathe out, breathe in, and you're all doing excellent. Well done. Good morning to everyone. Saroji, Kamreji, Yasuji, Harish Bhai, Jyoti Ji, Harish Ji. Excellent. I can just do the TLC again. Any time pain happening, this will release the tension in the muscle. Next, we do the interlock your finger with the back of the neck. Breathe in and put a pressure in each other. You don't have to hold your breath. You can breathe in breathing in that as well, no problem. Thank you. On the forehead. Then the right hand on the plane. The left hand. Then from the top, it doesn't look. <coughs> and relax. Next, we do the neck exercise. That's where the glands are as well. Your biggest nerve goes from the top all the way down the back of the ear, under the neck, to all the organs. So any neck exercise you do ex activates the vagus nerve as well. To activate the parasympathetic nerve system, which relaxes the body. So put your chin down first, let's rub over for 20 times. This will help to improve your thorough gland, your vocal cord, and balance your nervous system all in one. Excellent. Now you breathe in, you go up. Your chin should be touching the chest. If it's not, you can open your mouth. Okay. Next, you use your head like a pendulum. Excellent. Now we breathe in, look behind your back. Then you take the head on the first row, close wide.
then you do the reverse. Okay, we've done the next exercise and everything else as well. Now, we're going to do some, just a stretching exercise, like Tarasana sitting in the chair. Go all the stretch up as far as you can. And hold it for a few seconds, try to turn it. And then come back, what's more? Breathing in, you go all the way up. Once more. Next, you open up all the channel on the side. You stretch and you go sideways. Right. One left and two seconds. Then come back to middle breathing in. Excellent. Next, you have the front. Your right hand goes behind the back, left and the right. Next, you have the right Excellent. Next, you have there and breathing and the back. Excellent. Now, I think we should do that this exercise as well. O E A O E A O E A O E A and the last time O E Ah, next, make it sound like a um, motorbike backfiring. <clears throat> Once more. <clears throat> and for the last time. <clears throat> Next, also the tongue exercise we do. Take your tongue out, try to touch your nose with it, or try to close as possible and hold it for five seconds. And like, uh, once more. Excellent. Next, you take your tongue out and swap your left finger leg like right, left, right there. Excellent. Next, you put this thing out and suck it back in. Nobody wants a double chin. You take your chin up and stretch your neck. And left. Then go sideways, right? And then left, up.
this week. These are all the faces they have to say. Trying to get the all the lymph fluid flowing from the face. The best way to do is you use your in the face, the lymph fluid is just on the surface of the skin. You don't dump the press you have, use your the lymph fluid channel is up from the face, go behind the ear, down the neck, into the inner channel. You just drop it gently. Let me highlight it. Gently. Then on the right, then you see everything going bang here. Excellent. Next, you need to turn your body like a mixer. When you're doing it, breathing in the middle and do Kapalvati going out of way. Excellent. Next, we're going to do the limb fluid one, very important one. Before we do that, <laughs> you're sitting comfortably, your hand up front, and you, you can do that for at least 25 times. Breathe in, go up, and you go down. Breathe in. Breathe in. Excellent. Next, drag your leg apart on the side by each hand, touching your toes or whatever you need to, and be there. Right. Excellent. Well done. Take a couple of deep breaths if it has. Just to run again. Excellent. Take the leg in the front. And in the Ling Mudra, you do the grinding. If you go back, you breathe in, you go forward.
and 15. Thank you, Mr. Burr. Excellent. Just to get the energy back in, just sitting in Jan Mudra, focus on the breath for 30 seconds. Next, we go to the groin. We do the breath. Sitting on the floor, do the butterfly, other the same chair, you put your hand there. That's the sound of being on the floor, excellent. No problem. Jyoti ji, see Jyoti ji, you Excellent. Next, you're going to extend the leg. So put your right leg on the palm down like that. Breathe in. And the first one. And the reverse. Then cycling. And the reverse. Excellent. Now the opposite leg. Okay. Again, just sitting down with that, take a couple of deep breath again. Just 10 seconds. What I like to do now is do meditation for one minute. That is self, any pain you have, body will relax again. So all I want to do is sit down comfortably in Yan Mudra. And just focus on your heart, your third eye, or the upper lip. And just try to focus on yourself for one minute, breathing, deeper breathing. Your body will go in relaxation mode. Whatever pain you have will go away.
explain to you both and again. You'll find this time you went into say learn to control your mind better than last time. And the more you do it, better you get at it. Six minutes. Keep it one leg is straight, bend one leg and throw it. Leg. Excellent. Let me get set for two. I need to move my camera slightly. Then we will do it back and forth. Do it to the gout, very back it. You can do your gout, the first kind of arthritis. Then the host to put forward. Back. It's the prevention of cramp in the face. Full force here. Prevention. Because regularly, no one has something. Then To the whole exercise, okay, to all the right. next is obviously the lymph fluid one. This one, obviously, remember the six central lymph node in the body, you connect to your calf muscle. You groin, the stomach, under the armpit, in the throat, and the ear. There are 600 lymph nodes, they are located in these six locations. They have to be, there is no pump in them, so you have to exercise them. If you don't exercise them, lymph fluid doesn't flow and become deposited and becomes a lump in the body. Don't need to be cancerous, but it could become cancerous as well. So it's very important for lymph fluid to be flowing all the time. For that, for the calf muscle one, all you do is heal and toe. Just heal and toe exercise, or you all the same. Heal, toe, heal, toe. 
And also, you, you can just if you're sitting down the chair, I thought you had to stop it. The other one is you go out and then. And for the groin, you do the butterfly, which is already done. And for the stomach one, you tap it like that. Or we do that. The fall part, you can do that later on anyway. Let's do that for just 30 seconds. Any mudra at all, you put so many mudra both of them. Under the armpit. Yeah. You see the hand there, you see he done that, he's tapping under the armpit. And then next three thing you have the arm there. You press your heart and if you use your finger, your pump. And for the year, just over the year. Then hold your middle ear and turn around clockwise. And, and keep your Good. You managed to go through the whole thing. Now let's, we've done some of the breathing exercise. We actually expand some lung as well. Push to the different mudra, chin mudra like this, upside down. And do bastiga for 10 seconds. This sends a prana to the bottom section of the lung. <coughs> and then do the palbati for 10 seconds. Then we use the Adi Mudra, come in the middle, thumb down, you bust the gap for 10 seconds. And then the power thing. Okay. Let's do some expansive lung to hand there. Excellent. Next, make a tight press, go up, 
Maybe they've done plenty of pain. One. Thank you. Excellent. We more or less we try to open all the energy channel to the whole body through the different exercises we've done so far. We've still forgotten one of the important organs. What we have forgotten? On anyone? Which one which exercise we haven't done for a long time? Which organ? Uh <laughs> one organ we Mandukasan. Mandukasan or something we haven't done at all for a long time, myself. Huh? Your, Your eyes. Your eyes. Eye exercise. Eye exercise. That is very important. Jinke pas eye eye we don't even see it. Yet. So let's just focus, keeping head still. Let me just highlight myself again. Keeping your head forward, not moving your head at all. If you look at the ceiling up, take your eyes off, look better. And then up. 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 Last time, up. Next, put your both hands on the side. Without moving your head, try to from the side of the eye, look at the right eye. Middle, left. Middle, right. Middle. 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 Excellent. Now you look around the circle, left, up, right, left, up, right, left, up, right, left, up, right. Now the anti way, right, up, left, left, right. Next, for you both come in the front, one come in the front, right hand. Focus your both eye on the tip of the thumb. Without moving in, try to keep looking at it. Gently, slowly bring your thumb towards you. As you come closer, closer, start looking cross eye. Hold it for five seconds. And relax. Have your hands together. Just create plenty of heat between the palm of your hand and cover your eyes and open your eyes to feel the eyes. Excellent. You might have to do the whole of it. Now let's do some Kapal Hatina in different mudra. First, Udan mudra, for your four finger touching to your like this. Put a cross there. You breathe in the middle and go sideways, do that. This way the blood pressure won't go up. Any that. The one thing is, if you're doing kapal bhati normally, just kapal, just breathing out forcefully, your blood pressure could rise as well. So if you are, if you're in that stage, then you have to breathe in and breathe out, breathe in and do kapal bhati at the same time. That way, you get more prana into your body and gives you help you to manage your health better. Next, in vayu mudra, you take this 
in the finger and the middle finger basal thumb. You do like that. Excellent. Next is the Pran Mudra, the little finger and the ring finger. Sitting like this. This one definitely you have to kapal varati and breathe in. That will extra prana will enter your body. Excellent. Next is Apan Mudra. We just go like this, put across there. Excellent. Next is the Suri Mudra, your ring finger, base of the thumb. It does help to lower your cholesterol and improve overall health, liver function. Next is the Ling Mudra. If you have low blood pressure, if you have high blood pressure, the Apan Vayu Mudra. The Ling Mudra for low blood pressure, people. Apan Vayu Mudra, Vayu Mudra, and Apan Mudra for high blood pressure. Excellent. Take a couple of deep breaths. Next one is the Ujjayi. The chin down. That helps to massage the thyroid gland, then close your right nostril and come up and breathe from left to cool it down. Like here. <laughs> <laughs> Next is unknown. Alpani lost to the Stomu Mudra, left hand, right hand, and Vayu Mudra.
Fine tuning of the chakra to the Muladhar, Swadhisthan, Stola Flex, Heart, Throat, and Thadam. You use the sound, the color, and the thing. So let's get in the Gyan Mudra. First, the Muladhar. Focus me on Muladhar, pull your back passes up. Keep a rectangle shape in front of your eye. Color that with red color. And chant the word. La la for ten times and finish it long. La 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 Next you just saw this time. Your left hand over right hand using your left half moon shape. Close your eyes, think of a dark night, half moon shining a silver lightning onto you. And focusing on Swadhisthan, make a sound of va va for ten times and finish with va. Va 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 va. Next is the solar plex. Interlock all your fingers using your index finger and your thumb create a triangle. Put that next to your solar plex. Pull the solar plex in. Close your eyes, think of a triangle shape in front of your eyes, and color that with sunflower color, yellow color. And focusing on solar flesh, which controls the digestive system. Say ra ra for 10 times and finish with ra. Ra 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 ra. Next is your heart. Both hands in Gyan Mudra. Left hand in the knee, right hand under your heart. Close your eyes, think of a light gray color cloud. And focus in your heart, make a sound of ya ya for 10 times and finish with the arm. Ya, 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 ya. Next is your thought and glass. Interlock the finger using your either say open thumb, you put around the neck. Close your eyes, think of a dark night, half moon, a full of stars, shining like a Christmas light, all the different color red, green, blue, purple. And focus on thought and glass, make a sound of ha ha for 10 times and finish with thumb. Ha 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 ha. Ha, ha, ha. Next is your third eye. Your index finger like that. So rub the third eye a few times. Gently bring this back to your heart. Physically or not, but mentally still rubbing the third eye. And make a sound of OM for three times. Oh. 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 Last but least, the ground check. Rub over your forehead. If you don't have hair, more benefit. And then interlock your finger, open your ring finger, and put your tongue in the kitchen mudra. And make a sound of like a bumblebee for three times. Mm. Mm. Gently take your both hand up in there. Mm. 
next we're going to do another meditation for one to two minutes. Just give it down with the or sitting like this. You'll find this time even we'll go deeper into it. Just breathing in and out gently. Close your eyes and put in Kichiri Mudra to make your mind focus on yourself at the present moment. Get you to the boat kind of in there. Don't know why you, but I find I went in much more deeper into meditation form, much easier. If we practice, makes it perfect. Let's do the prayers there first. May all be happy. May all be healthy. May all enjoy prosperity. May none suffer. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Let's roll like a lion to your hands like this. You can all unmute yourself. No problem. Ah! Ah! You ah. can hear you, you're muted. <laughs> ah. <laughs> well, last time. Ah. <laughs> Excellent. And for sake of duty, you let you want more. Ah. <laughs> Excellent. And massage your throat. And how do you go? And give me a laughter. Ah, you have a lovely weekend. Thank you. Hope you hope you enjoy the class. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Thank